see two major journals where you can submit your paper so uh, if you might be thinking why is it important to get your paper published or accepted why does a pre-final year student need a paper publication how to da- draft a paper and get it uh, accepted in top conferences and research uh, journals so if so if you if you are wondering how to do all of this then do watch the video till the end so the first journal that i will discuss is ijirst so this journal accepts papers really quick and they review your papers and come up with comments really fast within 1 to 2 days i have personal experience with this particular journal and i have submitted two papers to this journal itself and i have got the acceptance within 2 days so if you want to submit your paper to ijirst then go ahead and click this link over here and you will be able to submit your paper over here you need to fill the article the research area and all the required details and once everything is done you need to upload the final version of your paper and then submit the manuscript the second research paper research uh, journal i would be talking about is ssrn so even these uh, journal uh, owners uh, process your papers really fast and they have high acceptance rate and the publication fee is very minimal uh, the acceptance fee is free of cost in both of the journals they just charge you if you want to get it published uh, published in the journal but the acceptance is really free so the first question is why do you need a journal why do you need a publication or acceptance from a journal so if you would have done some project or some mini project or major project in your uh, college during the final year or pre final year stage then there is one advantage to take over that project so you can draft an ieee temp- formatted paper and then uh, and then submit that paper in these two journals and you will you will get the acceptance uh, really quick Uh, and you can also publish the paper in this uh, journals with a minimal cost as well if you want to publish it here but if you are waiting for some top conferences where you want to get it published but you have your interviews very quick then you can just get the acceptance from these two journals and then put it on your resume that you have got a research paper and you have accept uh, and that research paper has been accepted in this top journal so the interviewers will be really happy to see such content on your resume so this has high impact on your uh, performance in the interview so if you if you uh, if you have some mini project or some major project then draft an ieee formatted paper uh, i have the ieee template uh, link in the description below uh, do check out that as well and draft a paper similar to the ieee format uh i have published two papers in ssrn the link is also present in the description below do check that out how to draft the paper so one more last suggestion when you are trying to draft a paper you can have some other papers as reference while you draft the paper you can have some base paper which has a similar topic to yours but you have upgraded upon that topic then then you can use the content present in that uh, previous base paper a bit and then modify the content in such a way that the plagiarism level is below 20% you can use other uh, grammarly and other uh, platforms where you can reduce the uh, plagiarism the link to such tools is also present in the description below do check it out do like and subscribe if you like the content and share it across your friends and get get uh, shortlisted during the interviews Uh thank you guys thank you for watching keep supporting bye